Hey everyone, this is Tim from Your Shake Studios. Today I'm going to show you how to set up a new internet connection using a LAN cable on your Xbox One. So let's go ahead and jump into the video right now. No, this is not a phone cable. This is a LAN cable. It is much bigger and thicker. This will connect to the back of your Xbox One and it will also connect to your router. So on the back of my Xbox One, let's go ahead and plug in my LAN cable. It will be the port furthest on the right. So this is what the top end will be like. The little clip will be facing up. Slide it in and it will make a sound and it will be connected. Let's go over to my router and connect the other end. So here is my router and modem. I have an all-in-one unit. Now you may have a two separate ones, a router, and you'll know what one is a router because you'll probably have like ports on the back here that are flashing and lighting up where your LAN cable will connect to. And then your modem will essentially be just the one with the coaxial cable going into it. And there will be one LAN cable running from your router to your modem. Now let's go ahead and find an open port on my router and plug in my LAN cable. So here is an open port right here on the bottom. Let's go ahead and connect it. And I heard the click and it looks like it's lighting up right away. So my LAN cable is plugged in. So it is officially connected and it's going to my Xbox One. Now let's go ahead and fire up my TV and establish a new connection. On the home screen of the Xbox One, go ahead and press the Xbox button on your controller and open up the side menu. Now go to the right to the profile and system tab and scroll down to settings. Now go to general, then go to network settings. Now on the right hand side, it will show your current network status. It says wired. You can go down to test network connection and it's going to check your connection. Now when you're connected with a LAN cable on the Xbox One and is plugged in properly, you won't have to set up or establish a new connection because it will do it automatically. Just like if you would plug in a LAN cable to your computer, it's going to automatically establish a connection. So once we have that set up, we can go down to test network speeds and statistics and find or download and upload speed. So if you've been confused that there is no option to set up a new LAN cable connection, well, it's doing it for you in the background. So no worries. So it looks like my download speed is about 450 and my upload speed is 20. So I have a very solid connection with my download and upload speed. If this video did indeed help you out, go ahead and leave it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below for more Xbox One tech help videos coming up next.